foods to aggravate gout acids. There are some doctors who say, diet does not affect gout. This is often said about various diseases, but this can't be true, since you are what you eat. Eating a lot of acid food, keeps your blood and lymph liquid acidic. This in turn, increases the possibility of uric acid precipitating into harmful crystals. It also favors a variety of other diseases. Certain foods can activate a gout attack in your joints, especially in your feet, ankles, and legs. Eating excess purine foods has been identified as the chemical that leads to gout. But other unbalanced body conditions also contribute to gout. Not all people have excess uric acid in their blood, form or create urate crystals. Uric acid is not only created by food, but your body also creates it. When dead cells are broken down, there are many other ways uric acid is created in your body. Fats or fatty foods also play an important part in gout. If you have a high fat diet, these fats prevent your kidneys from removing the amount of uric acid that they should. The result is that an excess of uric acid remains in your blood. Now, even though you might have high uric acid in your blood and don't form gout, it does not mean that you are healthy. The high uric acid in your blood is a condition you don't want, since it leads to many other diseases. But, covered in this video, are the foods that are high in purine, and that you should cut back on, if you are prone to gout attacks. You don't have to eliminate these foods from your diet forever. You may need to limit the amount of these foods after you get gout under control. The diet in this program helps you create an alkaline body, making you less susceptible to gout. Meat All animal meat contains purine, such as red meat, organ meat, meat extracts, and some fish. So cut back on these meats. Some of the fish to avoid are herring, sardines, and mussels. Alcohol The beer has always been suggested to avoid when you have gout. It is also best to eliminate all alcoholic beverages, when you are in a gout attack. Baked Goods Baked goods, which have yeast, also contain purines and should be avoided. Soft drinks Soft drinks and other sugary drinks, which are high in fructose, can cause an excess of uric acid in your blood. Just one or two drinks a day can cause uric acid problems. Fruit juices can also cause uric issues, if they are not fresh and don't have enough fiber. Body illnesses Certain illnesses such as severe psoriasis, or blood disorders, create an excess of uric acid. If you have high blood pressure, kidney damage, obesity, diabetes, and many other diseases, you will be more susceptible to gout. Gout can also be associated with physical injuries, surgery, long hospitalization, or the use of drugs. Gout may also show up when you have some cancers or tumors. Gout is not always just a symptom that comes for a short time. Many people experience gout for weeks and even longer. Conditions that create gout Obesity Heavy alcohol consumption Diets high in purine foods, seafood, meat, meat organs Extremely low calorie diets Always using aspirin Regular use of niacin Frequently drinking high fructose drinks Quick weight loss kidney disease, high blood pressure, psoriasis, tumors, hemolytic anemia, lead poisoning, hypothyroidism surgery. Foods to avoid, if you have gout. Here is a list of food that you need to minimize or eliminate from your diet. Avoid or minimize the use of scallops, herring, tuna, anchovies, and meat during a gout attack. Reduce the use of red meat, chicken, pork, turkey, or lamb. Avoid eating animal skin and fatty meat. Limit the use of bouillon, commercially prepared gravies, or soups. Limit your use of chocolates. Avoid sodas and sugar, corn syrup, or fructose sweetened drinks. Avoid sweetbreads, chips, sugary products, and junk food. Avoid or minimize the use of asparagus, cauliflower, spinach, and mushrooms, peas, beans, and legumes. Eliminate liver and kidney meat. Stop drinking beer, tea, coffee, and cocoa. 
minimize your use of oats, but you can use them occasionally, like once a week.